Get ready to unlock the mystery of growing a thriving medical practice. Sherlock Doc is here to help. When negotiating the terms of a commercial lease for your medical practice, you have a lot of power. Unlike residential leases, the terms of a commercial lease are not set in stone and can be tailored to meet the individual needs of each lessee. Here's what to look for and what to expect from an ideal commercial lease contract. First, look for a short one to two year lease term with the option to renew. You don't want to be locked into a long-term lease if the space isn't right, but you also want the option to stay if the space turns out to be perfect. Second, make sure there are no hidden maintenance or utility fees. A good commercial lease should clearly state any extra costs you'll be responsible for. It's also a good idea to ask to see extraneous costs and charges that have been incurred by past tenants. Look for any hidden repair fees that have been buried into the terms of your commercial lease. While landlords typically take care of residential repairs, that's not always the case with commercial landlords. Make sure you understand what you're responsible for. Finally, a good commercial lease should include clear language and fair terms when it comes to defaulting on your lease. If you are unable to make rent payments, the lease should clearly state what will happen and how much time you'll have to catch up on those payments. Read your lease carefully and hire a commercial real estate attorney to help you understand any confusing points as well as fight for provisions that may be missing. Remember that when entering into a commercial lease agreement, you as a tenant have much more negotiating power than you would with a residential lease. To learn more about medical billing, insurance, coding, outsourcing, and everything you need to establish a successful healthcare practice, follow all of Sherlock Doc's adventures on the doctorsbusinessnetwork.com or Doctors Business Channel on YouTube.